Hey guys, it's Redemption9 here and welcome back to Hogwarts Legacy. Today we're going to continue on our journey in this game by going up there and speaking to Sebastian. Now in between episodes, a lot has changed and but when I say a lot, I mean a lot. I mean my outfit's changed. Look at me, I've gone dark wizard. I'm no longer like a student. I've sort of evolved into a powerful wizard, even though I'm not evil. But you know, I look, I look evil. I look a bit like Darth Vader minus helmet. Um, but yeah, in between episodes, I've done a lot to the point where I'm level 34 and was 76% through the game, which is just amazing. Uh, my gear is all legendary, which is great. Uh, the map is clear. Look at this. I've been everywhere. I've discovered everything. All the Merlin trials, they're done. All the wizard camp, bandit camp things, they're done. Flu flames discovered, uh, all the dens discovered, all the battle arenas done, everything is done. I've been everywhere and done everything. Uh, if we zoom out, I am missing 16 collection chests, but that's fine. One field guide page, but it's locked away in a castle somewhere. I've done all the Merlin Trials, all the ancient magic hotspots, all the balloons, all the demigod statues. I haven't done the astronomy tables, mainly because we need to do the mission first. Found all landing platforms and I've done most of the infamous foes, but some of them are locked behind quests, so you know. Essentially, we all we have to do left is the missions, which we're going to do today. So yeah, let's get on with it and speak to Sebastian, who is up here. Yo, what up, brother? Oh, he's not even here, it's just a circle. Oh my god, I'm inside it. of him. I am. Uh, no, I did. I made it. And I'm like more powerful than before. Enjoying the view. Keeping an eye on things. Feldcroft isn't what it used to be. No one has felt safe here since Ranrock's loyalists took a peculiar interest in that castle over there Rookwood Castle. My uncle Solomon is a former Aura and refuses to look into it, even after Anne was cursed by one of them, possibly with a wand, no less. I heard a goblin refer to wizard kind as wand carriers. A goblin's forbidden from carrying wands. Precisely. That's why I'm on the hunt for answers. If I'm to cure her, I need to understand what happened to her. Anne was always the most mischievous of the three of us, which is saying something, knowing me and Ominous. I'm hoping a surprise visit from me and a new friend from Hogwarts will help lift her spirits. Bring back the Anne I used to know. Come on, I'll take you to my uncle's. I think I've already been in there, you know. Come on, and take me to your uncle's. If it's a house I'm thinking of, oh, I've already looted it. Be a lot livelier. Handy With Ranrock's lot wandering about all the time, everyone stays out of sight. It's in here, isn't it? I've looted this place. Here I've already met Anne. My sister should be just inside. It wasn't locked last time. Aha! Sebastian, where did you? Is that what I think it is? We've been over this, boy. Hey. Shrivel figs cannot reverse a curse. Nothing can. The sooner you accept that reality, the better. But we haven't tried everything. There is no cure! When will you accept that? Never! I can never accept it. <laughs> now look what you've done. <laughs> I'm sorry. <laughs> I'm sorry you had to see that. If you don't mind, I just need a moment alone. Okay. Poor Sebastian. Not the visit he hoped for. I'll speak with Anne Solomon. Hey, Solomon. That boy will fray my last nerve. Excuse me, Mr. Sallow. Oh, yes. Sebastian's friend. I apologize on behalf of my nephew. He doesn't know when to stop. He thinks he can help Anne, oh, but nothing can be done for her. Uh, surely there's something? 
It could be that you've not yet discovered the cure. Ah, you sound like Sebastian, thinking you know better than the healers at St. Mungo's. Perhaps the healers don't know everything, sir. Sebastian is single-mindedly focused on finding a way to help his sister. If there is a cure, he will find it. Your faith in Sebastian is misplaced. Some sort of dark magic cursed Anne, and the goblins aren't likely to explain themselves any time soon. Giving her hope is cruel. The only thing to do now is keep Anne comfortable and stay out of the Loyalists' way. Uh, hope could be a good thing, though. With all due respect, sir, hope could keep Anne's spirits up. You may mean well, but I know what's best for Anne and Sebastian. They are my stubborn brother's children. Especially Sebastian. If you really want to be of help, you'll make sure Sebastian does what he should do, not what he wants to do. He's no idea the harm he could do if he doesn't stop. Right. You remember what I've said. Good day. But I... We could... Help, surely? It wasn't locked last time. I went into this place. I unlocked it. How dare you put a lock on the door? I know it's like your house and everything, but you know. I'm how dare sorry you? about earlier. Those bouts of pain are difficult to bear. And Sallow. Or, you know, as like I always say about Sebastian, and Swallow. Are you alright, Anne? I didn't mean to intrude. You didn't, truly. <laughs> and I'm alright. The pain from this curse comes in bouts. And often suddenly, it's not anyone's fault. It's nice to meet you, by the way. You must be the new fifth year Sebastian told me about. I am. Sebastian and I met during a rather lively duel in defense against the dark arts. Oh dear, Professor Hecate. She's a powerful witch. And she knows how to keep students like my brother and me in line. <sighs> I do miss Hogwarts. But I wouldn't mind being in Feldcroft, really, if it wasn't so dreary now. Between the goblins at the castle and my uncle fighting with Sebastian whenever he's home, it's not the cosy retreat it once was. Sebastian mentioned something about your uncle being an ex-Aura, but refusing to go after Ranrock's loyalists. I must say, I wasn't prepared for him to be as angry as he was. Uncle Solomon is frustrated by what happened to me and by Sebastian for thinking he can fix it. They both mean well, I know they do, but my uncle is right. This curse cannot be undone. I can feel it. Sebastian cannot take away my pain. Perhaps you can help him to understand that. Uh, I mean, I can try, surely? I'll do my best. I can promise to speak with him about it. Thank you. His search for a cure is futile, I'm afraid. I'm getting tired. I should probably rest. Thank you for stopping by. I wish you well. I ought to see how Sebastian's faring. I mean, surely there's got to be a way to, like, do it, right? Hey, Sebastian. Why will he not listen to me? She's my sister. How are you doing, Sebastian? You got a first-hand glance of what I'm dealing with. I apologize for my uncle. Uh, he's trying to do what's right. I know he's angry, but he's only trying to do what he thinks is best for Anne. He's always angry. He's been angry since my parents died. After Anne was hurt, he only grew worse. It's as though he blames me somehow, always calling me my father's son, as if that's an insult. I'm the one trying to help her. He's simply given up. Both Anne and your uncle seem genuinely convinced that nothing more can be done for her. I refuse to believe that. Anne's pain is more than physical. It has changed her entirely. I miss my sister, and I'm going to get her back. Come with me. I need to show you where it happened. Okay, and where are you taking me? Are capable of so much more than people realize. They should not be underestimated. I mean, I've killed quite a few of them, so you know, well, I, I kind of know. It's from whatever's going on at that abandoned estate. They've been digging for something. Digging for what? Sebastian, I've been all over this world. I should know there, everything. On that plateau is where they cursed Anne. This way. Okay. 
can we just run there all the time instead of just walking? Hit an enemy with Descendo Shockwave. Use Mandrake. I should probably get some spells out. Uh, I want that. I want that. And then the Pulso. Cool, then. Use a Mandrake. Okay, I can do that. Of course, I do that. Right, cool then. No on that. Hit an enemy with a shockwave. What's that? What? Did that not work? I'm a very powerful wizard now. Are you finished? Oh. Nah. Don't think I have made a mistake, you know? Why can't you hit me? Because you're quite crap, you know that, right? What does hit an enemy with a Descendo Shockwave mean? I've been doing that. But apparently it doesn't work. Strange. Come on. There we go. There's more. Cool then. Oh, damn it. Sebastian. Are you just spawning more of them? You missed. I confess that was a bit more than I bargained for. I tried to warn you. That was like what I'm used to, mate. What are you talking about? I'll repair that. May as well while I'm here, you know. Get repaired. Oh. Those loyalists deserved what they got. Couldn't agree more. This is where it happened. We smelled smoke in the middle of the night. When we looked outside, flames were shooting from the estate. Before my uncle and I could stop her, Anne rushed out, racing towards the fire, worried someone would be hurt. She came face to face with a horde of goblins, frantically trying to stamp out the flames. Suddenly, an icy voice drifted out from somewhere in the smoke. Children should be seen and not heard. A blinding blast followed. They didn't even give her a chance to run. They were killed for no... They were trying to hide something? It seems an awfully violent response to a child wandering by. What were they trying to hide? My thoughts exactly. It may be grasping at billywigs. But I keep thinking that there might be something here that could lead me to whoever cursed Anne. Might be the only way to learn what type of magic harmed her. Which could help me find a cure. Perhaps you're right. The loyalists are everywhere, but they do seem to be spending a lot of time here. And it's likely they're hiding something. And at Rookwood Castle. Shall we have a look around? Yeah, go on then. Um... Set up camp here for a specific reason. They have stations for everything. I've heard that goblin dig sites like these are popping up everywhere. Hmm. It's a wonder the Ministry isn't doing more. There's quite a few things here that probably shouldn't be here. There's a whole camp up there. Whose home was this? A bit abandoned long since I've lived here. Rumour was a Hogwarts professor lived here once, centuries ago. Anything up here? That's all I ever heard. Revelio. House. Oh. I mean, there's a wow. Wow, wow, wow. This well looks familiar. Does it? Sebastian, I've seen this before. This house, the well, the view. What do you mean? When? Give me a moment. I'll explain in a second. 
Does do we mean from like the pensive? How do we get in there? How do we get in there? Ugh. I can't use my broom. Oh, I, I just walked through the front door. I did not see that. Oh. Sebastian. Over here. Do you think that this was damaged by the fire the night that Anne was cursed? Could be. But it looks to me as though this was intentional. Rebellio. Right, okay. Sebastian. This house did belong to a Hogwarts professor. Hundreds of years ago. Who? What do you... I found a pensive that day in the restricted section with a memory that showed this house. There was a little girl and a drought. The keepers have shown me other memories as well. The girl became a Hogwarts professor. Her name was Isadora Morganark. She was one of the keepers. The keepers? Like in Quidditch? And you found a pensive in the library? I'm not following you. I realize it's a lot to take in. I'm not even sure I understand it all yet. And no, not like Quidditch. They call themselves keepers because they're protecting some type of knowledge. It has to do with the vault at Gringotts. Let me see if I've got this straight. You have Ranrock and Rookwood after you because of something you found at Gringotts where you ended up via a port key. You can see traces of an ancient magic that you think Ranrock is trying to harness. And now you've been witnessing memories left by keepers. Oh, and this house belonged to a Hogwarts professor who was one of these non-Quidditch keepers hundreds of years ago. If I didn't know you, I think you were pulling my leg. It is all a bit much, isn't it, when you put it like that? The point is, we both have good reason to search this house. You for answers about what happened to Anne, and me for answers about the keepers. Look at this. What? Someone piled this here for a reason. Is it blocking something? Only one way to find out. Do you want me to do it, or are you Good gonna thing. do it? Fine, I'll do it. Huh, a stairwell. Stairwell in a bedroom. Not weird. There's mist down here, what's going on? Lumos. Why bother blocking a stairwell? There might be something here worth a closer look. They've left all of this simply strewn about. Tells me they're after something bigger. Entry one of seven. What? There we go. Blah blah blah. Entry of Isadora's. I should hold on to this. Two of seven. Blah blah blah. Seems these journal entries are from Isadora's travels. Can I light them? No. Revelio. Confringo. Nailed it. Oh, she got. Lumos. You're not going to believe this. I can see the Undercroft. What? A daydream? Because that happens to me too. No, I can see it through that mirror, apparently. Undercroft of Hogwarts? I know it sounds strange, but. Honestly, I nothing you say sounds strange to me anymore. Fair enough. I can see the Undercroft through this stone wall as though it's a window. This has happened before. I'm listening. I think it's to do with my ability to see traces of ancient magic. But you said you didn't really understand it and that you couldn't wield it. That's true. I'm still not sure what it all means. What I do know is that my ability allows me to travel through these windows I see. Wait. We can get straight to the Undercroft from here. <laughs> Ominous will be flawed. We can. But perhaps best not to tell anyone else about this for now. Even ominous. Understood. Well then, invisible secret ancient magic passageway, here we come. I'm tempted to hold my breath. Uh, can he? He can't. And do we have to hold hands? What do we do? Why would the door lead us here? Sebastian, look. Hmm. 
Why hide a triptych here? Seems as if something's missing. Have I got to go around collecting stuff again? Let's have a look. Okay. Anything helpful in the notes? Nope. Not at all. I don't understand it. A rune symbol. I've seen similar symbols used by the keepers. I've been thinking. A keeper lived in that house centuries ago, and Ranrock and his lot have been searching there. You said that goblins may be wielding some form of this ancient magic. Do you think Anne was cursed by ancient magic? I can't be sure, of course, but I don't think so. I didn't see any traces of it around your sister. Hmm. Very well. But that doesn't mean it's not ancient magic. There's still so much we don't know about it. True. Perhaps this triptych will lead us to answers. Then we'll have to unravel what this all means. But now I need to see Ominous. Don't worry, I won't tell him anything. Did I mention that, apparently, Salazar Slytherin had a secret scriptorium here, in Hogwarts? You did not. Sounds worth looking into. Any idea where in the castle? No idea. Ominous just learned of it. I'll let you know what I find out. I had no idea our visit to Sian would unfold into all of this. My head's an utter mess. But I'm glad you told me everything you did. I'll be in touch. Till then. Right, okay, later. So what do I do with this? Oh, level up, level up. Ah, oh, so close. So what do I do now? I've got nowhere to go. Nothing to do. Where's the entrance? Or exit? Oh, I've got a new quest. Astronomy cat. Oh, I need that. That's what I need. Because then I get like the. Oh. The ruins of Falbottom Castle. After dark, do not tell anyone. Okay, so now I've got two quests. Meet you where? Okay, fair enough. Hang on. That's where I couldn't go because it's locked off. Ah, oh, next episode is going to be so interesting. We have like two things to do that are major things. Interesting. Um, but here, I think it's a good place to end it because like I have no idea how long the next stuff is going to take. Um, so yeah, that is it for this episode, guys. And I'll see you next time when we continue on our journey in Hogwarts Legacy. Bye.